I'm Charlie Westbrook. I work at Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory in California. Uh, my activities are focused on developing chemical kinetic models for combustion fuels. I'm the president of the Combustion Institute and uh, I'm the chief scientist for the Model Fuels Consortium organized by Reaction Design. Uh, everyone is working on alternative sources of energy, but we're focusing on hydrocarbons today because that's the fuel we have. We have plentiful supplies that will look like they might be able to last for another hundred years. We yeah. use hydrocarbons and petroleum-based fuels uh, for combustion today because they are the cheapest and the most uh, common fuels and uh, are present in the largest quantities. Uh, we expect that we have at least 100 years more of these fuels uh, to be used and uh, it's going to take probably 100 years before any other alternative sources of energy are important enough to replace all of these hydrocarbon fuels. Uh, you know, the, the questions they were asking is very simple is why after all these years are we still interested and still worried about combustion? Isn't it an old science? Isn't it, 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 combustion goes back to cavemen. Uh, and so you thought that maybe we'd rung up, rung out all of the interesting things that we needed to know about combustion, but it never gets old, it never gets boring, and uh, we still have important things that we have to, to solve if we're going to get through this next hundred years uh, cleanly and responsibly and uh, get to this great new world that we're going to get with real renewables and solar energy and nuclear reactors and all these other things that are going to be much cleaner than combustion has ever been, but we've got to get there.